Uh, my colleagues, uh, I arise here uh, at a request of many veteran service organizations and veterans across, across the country who have called for a long time for us to protect our military and veteran students and close the 90-10 loophole. What was once a partisan discussion is becoming a bipartisan discussion. And while the American Rescue Plan closes the 90-10 loophole, we need to make sure we do it in the right way, make these changes in the correct way, and we need to ensure that we put the policy back in uh, the perspective of not politics, but the right answer. I'm thankful to my colleagues, Senator Carper and Cassidy and Langford for putting that politics aside, working on this amendment with me, and I also want to thank Chairman Murray and Ranking Member Burr and their staffs, as well as the veteran groups and the stakeholders for their help in crafting this amendment. By providing a six-month delay before the start of a negotiated rulemaking process, Congress now has time to work together with our veteran service organizations, the higher education community, on a bipartisan plan to deliver reasonable and needed protections for veterans and taxpayers alike. I ask my colleagues to join us in support of our bipartisan amendment and continue to work with us on a path forward this Congress.